David is with us. How are you doing, David? Good to see you. Thank you very much. It's been, uh, well, I guess this is the first time that you've been to our, well, I know here, but I mean, have you been in this country before? No, it's the first time in the States. Wow. Yeah. How do you like it so far? Great. Incredible. You do? Well, what part of you? Very, very pleasant <laughs> surprise. Um, well, I, I came through to Washington first. Mm-hmm. Uh, I just got here today. Well, what part of, uh, you from England, right? What yeah. part of England are you from? Well, south of London, about 12 miles south. A place called Beckenham in Kent. It's a uh, country. Fight. Is it what kind of place is it? Is it the, the typical industrialized London that we, you know, that we see? Yeah, it's out of well, the, the bit I live in. Well, yeah, yeah. the bit I live in is is, is quite countryfied, really. Oh, really? Mm. We just miss the industry. Mm. Oh, we haven't got much industry in England. No. It's all petered out. <laughs> no, I thought it was like great smokestacks. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, like, that's up north. Yeah. Oh, I see. Yeah. I think Ray Davies uh, of the Kinks uh, oh, was telling me that he. Well, yeah, yeah, he likes it here. Uh, yeah, he's just telling me that he he can't stand England. Uh, uh, that he really likes America, you know. Mm-hmm. And it's it's good that uh, that the Kinks are really uh, becoming more successful here, I think, than they have been, you know, for a while. Uh, I think I like both countries. Do you? I mean, yeah, I, I wouldn't give up England. I've never I, been I, to England. Ex- you know. I'd like to get there someday. Uh, let me see. It says here that you are one of those English. I'll add lib this. Here. Right. You're one of those Englishmen who has happened upon the pop scene and just captured the hearts and minds of, of all, all of the, the audiences, audiences that have heard him. Isn't that wonderful? Wow. Yeah. Did you know that? I'm quite a guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You're, let me see. It says also that you're. I'm reading this bio here because I just received it here, and some interesting things about you here. Did you know this? That your name was <laughs> David Robert Jones, but oh, yeah. that Davy Jones of the Monkees claimed the name. Yeah. And you, you became David Bowie. Where did you get that name? Just pick it up. Um. Well, from the town, and from the person, and it just sounded nice. It's Scottish as well, and there was a knife involved, and it just sounded good. <laughs> well, Elton John. I was mentioning that Elton John was here, and. Referred to you as David Bowie, mm-hmm. and we call you David Bowie, mm-hmm. and uh, and I think it is really Bowie. Well, I call it Bowie, but well, you, you know, it I, matter. I really think you're you're the authority on that, you know. Call oh, Elton John, if you like. <laughs> yeah, well, Elton John is is Reg Dwight, so what does he know? You know. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna... Yeah, I didn't know that. <laughs> you didn't? No. <laughs> yeah, his real name is Reg- Reginald Dwight. Gosh, and he changed it to... Oh. <laughs> well, all right. Uh, tell me you're really Bernie Taupin, and then we'll get on with it. Um, we're going to play your uh, your Space Oddity track. I'd like you to maybe pick out a few songs that you like uh, from different albums, and maybe right. tell, us, tell us about it. But what can you tell us about uh, Space Oddity? Uh, other than... Oh, has the new wide... Martin Buckle and uh, the micro, uh, micro adjuster tension control. Yes, you'll find Riker boots and plenty of good advice at the Mogul Ski Shop, which is, of course, as you know, 2102 Market Street. Yeah. That's just down a few blocks from here. Get to the moon and let us know. Okay. Okay.